Welcome. Today we're taking a look at the new utility items coming to Vainglory in Update 1.19. For the first time, we're seeing new items created specifically for roamers, which will change the way that a roam hero can start out, allowing you to choose something other than an Iron Guard contract, a scout trap, and flares. In all, there are six brand new utility items along with Iron Guard contract receiving a significant rework. So, let's take a look at what's new. First up is Flare Gun. This is a new item which differs from existing consumable flares. Next is War Treads and Halcyon Chargers, two new mobility items with different underpinning mechanics. There's a Stormcrow item, a new offensive slash aggressive utility pickup. And we have two new contracts, Protector Contract and Dragon Blood Contract, with Iron Guard Contract receiving changes in the way it works. So let's get into the detail. First we have Flare Gun. This is a tier 2 item which gives you the ability to keep up vision and improve your hero durability. This item gives you access to use a flare every 20 seconds whilst granting you additional health. The next item is War Treads, a new tier 3 item built out of movement speed and health granting you a plus 0.4 passive movement speed a plus 500 health and a two second activatable sprint for you and nearby allies. This item replaces Warhorn, but it's worth noting it does not give you Iron Guard or Storm Guard banner passives. Next up is Halcyon Chargers. Built from energy and boots, this new tier 3 item gives an impressive plus 0.5 passive movement speed and a full three second activatable sprint double that of tier 3 boots. You'll also benefit from additional health, cooldown speed, energy, and regen. An excellent pick to aid mobility and durability. Storm Crown is the last new item within the utility section. Choose this item if you're more of an aggressive roamer. Built from Storm Guard banner and cooldown speed, the Storm Crown grants you additional bonus true damage after using an ability coupled with additional health, cooldown speed, energy, and regen. It's worth remembering that Storm Guard Banner is now built from energy battery and no longer from Iron Guard contract. On to the other section where we can find two new contracts and the reworked Iron Guard. Starting with Iron Guard, this has changed significantly. Gold is no longer earned from this item. This has been replaced with ambient gold and always on mechanic within the game, whether you have a contract or not. With ambient gold, whenever anyone kills a minion or monster, a nearby ally within 14 meters earns 75% of the bounty as bonus gold. If two allies are nearby, whoever has the lower net worth earns the ambient gold. Back to Iron Guard contract. Now, when a jungle monster is killed by a nearby ally, you and your ally heal for 75 health each. The first of the two new contracts is the Protector Contract. As the name suggests, this item helps you as a roamer to protect your allies. Activate to grant a 120 health barrier to the nearest ally hero for 2 seconds. It's worth noting this protection is only cast to the single nearest ally, so positioning and timing is key. The second new contract is the Dragon Blood contract. This is a more aggressive item which, when activated, applies a mark to enemy heroes for a short period, which, when attacked by an ally, deals bonus crystal damage and applies a slow. The new utility items in Vainglory provide a brand new way to engage, defend, and attack for roamers. Try them out now and discover for yourself how you can help your team to